Hey hi everyone this is admin from admin365 and today we are going to talk about how to create a backup of emails from outlook so let's get started so um we have the outlook open here and as you can see we have one account and all the emails in here for us to for us to take the backup we have to click on file open and export then import and export and then export to a file then next and select the outlook PST file and then next and uh, select the entire account if you want to back up the entire account but if you only want to back up the inbox you can select this as well Uh, if you have multiple accounts you may see them below it but you can select the account which you want backup it will include all the subfolders within the account and then you have to click on next and uh, you just have to select the location where you want the backup to be stored and uh, this option should be as it is uh, you just have to click on finish will ask for the password if you want to make it secure uh, you can go ahead and enter the password but if you don't want to add a password you can just simply hit ok so I'm not going to do that because it will take a lot of time and uh, let us talk about how to import the PST to the account from Outlook so we'll go to file and then open and export import and export and import from another program or file next outlook data file next replace all the duplicates that's fine uh, browse it to the location where you have the backup PST exported so um, you just have to click on browse and select the PST file and then you have to click on next and select the outlook data file it will show uh, it will show all the content within it and you just have to select the account in which you want to import the emails to as I have only one account in Outlook you will see only this under the drop down but if you have multiple you just have to uh, select that account and then hit finish and uh, if you don't wish to have it in any account but still want to view it you just have to select uh, the first option that will just attach the out outlook data file as you can see it on the left side the same way and you can just expand it and view all the emails so uh, for example we will do the second option and hit finish and it will start to import all the contents and I didn't have any anything in the backup PhD so it will not do anything but you will see a window here which basically states and show the, shows you the progress do let me know guys if you have any question about this and till then you have a nice day bye bye